Hello and welcome. My name is Bradley Mayer Herman and today I have the pleasure of sitting down with Rob Duffy. Rob is running for town council in the town of Orangeville. Thank you for being here today, Rob. Thank you for having me. So today I want to talk about uh, working together. In the past, the council has been seen as butting heads, mm -hmm. openly dis disagreeing. If in that position, what would you personally do to make sure that situation doesn't happen? Okay, that's a fair question. I've been asked the question, councillor issues and roadblocks have existed in the past. How would I help to resolve the issue of conflicts between councillors that have historically plagued this council so they don't recur this time around? My answer to this is, the residents of Orangeville need to feel comfortable that they are adequately represented. For this, they need to be able to select from a group of candidates that best represent their viewpoint. There is an onus on voters to learn about their candidates and make informed choices about who will best serve their needs and those of Orangeville. I urge you to put seven individuals who share a common vision and value system in the council. These would be candidates who are reasonable, result-oriented, and will take calculated business risks. Listen actively to the residents and understand and commit to the greater vision and goals of the community as outlined in the Council's vision and value statement. This must be done in a civil and respectful manner with a focus on meeting con common objectives. I will work in partnership with Council in an effective and efficient manner. I believe we must maintain partnerships with community stakeholders. I believe in a personal and professional code of conduct and would expect the incoming council to adhere to Orangeville's existing code of conduct for council and committees. I've had a long career of adhering to and enforcing various codes of conduct and have no problem holding others accountable. There are lessons to be learned from the recent decision of the province to restructure Cronos Council. They were plagued by inefficiency and unable to properly function to the benefit of the city and were cut significantly in order to promote that efficiency. A position on council is a privilege, the privilege of serving our community for four years. Being accountable to the town's residents is everyone's responsibility and I, along with other councillors, must model those behaviours. Well, thank you very much for coming in and speaking to this, Rob. It's important. And if you'd like to see what uh, Rob has to say about other topics, please do take a look at the links below. And thanks for watching.